A lot of people see my situation and not think that I'm not high function. What situation? Okay, so I'm not married. I have beautiful children. How many? Eight. By how Eight. many women? Three. And this is the kicker. I want more. By multiple women? What's the intent? I just want God to your bring wife? them. I just want God to bring them. Oh, okay. My desire to get married is lower than my fear of divorce. So, as you had said, Dr. Bryant, you said it, I didn't say it, I will agree. I'm just taking my time. You're not taking your time. I am, though. You're being very action-based. You're not taking your time. I'm taking my time. You're being very action-based. You have eight kids yeah. with three different women. Yes. You are creating, procreating, and multiplying. That is not taking your time. You're being very selectively active. Mm. Okay? So you're creating, mm -hmm. in disclaimer, the kids are innocent. They are beautiful and amazing. Anything I say has nothing to do with them babies. But you are proactively choosing where you want to be active at and where you want to take your time. Mm -hmm. You want to take your time in having a wife because of your own fears. But you will, and I say this with all respect and love, what I'm about to say next, okay, Cam? But you will selfishly create broken families, even if you're in their life and you're a proactive father, and I believe you're an amazing daddy. I can only imagine with just your presence and, and knowing you. But these families are still broken. Every child cannot have Papa in the house with them. So some child, if not all, all will end up with some kind of deficit without daddy being there. Mm -hmm. Now, you chose to do that. I'm not saying you sat there and woke up one morning and said, I want to be selfish today, so I'm going to go make a baby. Not saying that at all. But those are selfish acts at the expense of your fear. And yeah, that is a low functioning behavior to say that I'm going to build these houses and put kids and these beautiful women and kids in them, but I ain't going to create a home in them. I'm going to wait till I dissipate my fear to find a wife where I'm still going to be fearful with because there's no such thing as not having some type of nerve or some type of feeling behind marrying somebody. And then I'm going to build a home with her while all these other beautiful babies have houses. That's completely unfair and that's selfish. And so, yes, you're taking your time in this department, but you're not taking your time in this department, which means you're compartmentalizing. And compartmentalizing never works. Compartmentalizing hurts everybody involved. Everybody who's in this box and that box and this box and that box and this box. And then here you go over here trying to figure out what box you're going to feed or entertain or do. Then you're looking outside to figure out who's your next victim to put in the box. It's unhealthy.